When you decide to go out to your favorite fishing hole, reeling in that fish starts out with knowing your equipment. Hi, I'm Ashley Edwards with the Missouri Department of Conservation. Today we're going to be going over your basic tackle. Fishing line comes in all different sizes and colors. You've got your 15 pound line, your six pound line, and your two pound line for a few examples. If you're fishing for a smaller fish, you can use a smaller poundage line. If you're fishing for a larger fish, you want to use a larger poundage line. We're going to go over your three basic fishing hooks. First, we have your Aberdeen. It's got a longer shank and a wider gap. This is good for beginners. Then, we have your bait holder. So it has two barbs on the shank so that it's easier to hold your bait. And then we have your treble hook, which is three separate hooks melded together. And these are good for things like catfishing for when you wanna put on stink bait or doe bait. So now we're gonna talk about weights. You use weights on your line to cast out further and to get your bait down deeper. There are several different types of weights. Your egg weight, your rubber grip, your bullet, and your split shot. The most commonly used is the split shot. So now we're going to talk about bobbers. Bobbers are a good indicator of when you have a fish interested in your bait. You've got the round floating bobber, the foam bobber, the slip bobber, and your spring bobber. Depending on what you're fishing for, you're going to want to use the lightest bobber possible. Now that you know more about your fishing equipment, watch our video on how to attach your sinker bobbers and hooks. 